have you ever looked around your life and thought, uh-oh, <laughs> this isn't temporary? From Weakness to the Brand, I want to touch on too, you bring up your time on Worst Cooks. Oh, yes. Edition. Yes. Feast your eyes. Oh. We're going to get spicy. With back-to-back -back episodes of Worst Cooks in America Celebrity Edition. I think they had six hours uh, between us doing a 16-hour day and and everybody else, I mean, I was the weakest link. Uh, Ian Zeering, 90210, uh, Latoya Jackson, 20th Century American History, everyone else were uh, champions, mm -hmm. were just um, delightful and bright-eyed and bushy-tailed for multiple hours a day. Uh, so I'm just saying, uh, yeah, that I'm, uh, I lied to get on the show is what I'm trying to say. <laughs> and Maria. Funny jokes. Funny jokes. I don't know what I thought I was going mm -hmm. <laughs> like, to was like, I thought, I kind of thought maybe it was going to be like it was okay to be bad at cooking and that you'd just kind of make <laughs> right. fun. And then it's like, no, 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 no. They want you to learn. They want you to learn to do it well. Mm -hmm. oh. <laughs> it's a bummer. Learning. It really, well, <laughs> yeah, it was like in real time, we're going to yeah. be learning. <laughs> Heads up, if you're going to do something non-union, um, it, and I could not imagine how hard the people were working um, camera and the, I mean they were there for much longer hours and uh, yeah and not treated not treated to seaweed snacks mm -hmm. um, <laughs> like we were um, so yeah uh, I, I, I people work extremely hard and uh, let's acknowledge that <laughs> I'm trying to learn to cook Everybody always says how easy it is to cook, but it is not any easier than not cooking. <laughs> Would you ever consider another reality show? Well, I'd like to have my own, mm. of course. Uh, it'd be very short. <laughs> it'd be very short, little tiny segments um, where uh, I do the least amount of help I can help somebody with. Like, it, like a small projects thing, like just go, let's clean out your uh, silverware drawer. And then, um, then well, let's just embrace it. like a before and after show where everything remains the same. <laughs> but it, but it's like, wasn't this great? <laughs> You're great. And there's no because I do love makeover shows, but the thing that's irritating about it is just you go, so I, so whatever. You spend six thousand dollars on a new wardrobe, and then you gotta. You're gonna fuck it up. You're gonna get the gre grease all over it, and you know, grow out of the pants and. Like, let's just do something small that'll feel good. <laughs> and uh, yeah, so th th that's that's my my pitch. Uh, I love that. I'm very yeah. Okay, thank you. I think that's gonna get greenlit. Yeah, yeah, right. yeah. Right. So quick, so easy.